The five coins of Yugoslavia rare of value. The 1995 Dinara coin was issued during the government of the extinct state of Yugoslavia which existed from 1918 to 2003 passing through various institutional forms. On the obverse you will see the official coat of arms of the country depicted by fire torches. Enclosed by a crown. Under the face value of 5 dinara. The latter is the official currency of the country or the Yugoslav dinar. On the reverse, the image representing the 29th edition of the Chess Olympics. Organized in 1990 in the city of Novi Sad. In today's Serbian territory. First under the rule of Yugoslavia. The competition brought together 106 nations made up of 108 teams. The Soviet Union was victorious. Today this coin made of copper, zinc and nickel weighs 8.5 grams. It has a diameter of 29 millimeters. And is worth $7. The 5 para from 1920 are part of the Yugoslav dinar currency. The dinar is made up of 100 para or cents. On the obverse the royal coat of arms of Peter I is depicted. King of Serbia, Croatians and Slovenes. The first ruler who reigned for three years from 1918 to 1921 in Slovenian lands. That were about to become a single nation or Yugoslavia. On the reverse the number 5 which indicates the face value of the coin. Around the writing para or cents. Under the year of minting 1920. Coin composed of zinc has a weight of 2.6 grams. A diameter of 18 millimeters. Worth $8 in the collector's market. The 1000 Dinara coin from 1980. It was issued to commemorate the year of Josip Broz Tito's death. Political revolutionary and Yugoslav dictator. Who ruled Yugoslavia for 27 years from 1953 to 1980. On the obverse you will see the official emblem of the country within the boundaries of the Yugoslav map. Around the inscriptions in the Serbian language which translated mean the Federal Socialist Republic of Yugoslavia. Below the nominal value of the coin shown in number. On the reverse, the bust of Titus. His name is linked to an iron dictatorship that caused a lot of discontent in the country. On the right the year of birth and death of the revolutionary politician. On the left his name and surname. Coin composed of silver for 0.9 grams has a diameter of 39 millimeters. It weighs 26 grams in total. And is worth $25. During the 8th edition of the Mediterranean Games this 150 dinara coin from 1978 was issued. The games consisted of competitions in 26 different sports disciplines. In which 2048 athletes from 14 different nations competed. On the obverse you will see the bust of the then ruler of the town or Titus. His name is shown on the left of his face. Immediately after the inscription in the Serbian language which translated means. 8th edition of the Mediterranean Games. On the reverse, the image of the port city that hosted the games in 1978 or split. Tad, a Croatian city. The games were played by all the nations that overlooked the Mediterranean Sea. From Morocco to France, from Italy to Turkey. The edition was won by 56 gold from Yugoslavia. Followed by France with 55 golds. And from Italy with 49 gold medals. Coin composed of silver for 0.9 grams. Has a diameter of 30 millimeters. It weighs 12.5 grams in total. Worth $38. The 50 dinara of 1932. They were issued by the extinct state during the Kingdom of Yugoslavia. Led by Alessandro Karad Ordovic. First King of Yugoslavia. He is remembered for his iron fist used against the various ethnic differences present in the newborn Yugoslavia. On the obverse you will see his face. He ruled the country for five years from 1929 to 1934. Around the writings that mean. Alexander I King of Yugoslavia. On the reverse, the official emblem of the country or the double-headed eagle. Represented by two eagle heads with a royal crown on top. Below the face value expressed both in numbers and in letters or 50 dinara. The year of minting instead you can see it on the sides of the eagle's wings. 19 on the left and 32 on the right. Or year 1932. Coin composed of 0.75 grams of silver. Has a diameter of 36 millimeters. Weighs 23 grams. And is worth $61.